Cable pull downs in front is a great back exercise. And it's a great back exercise to do at the beginning of a back routine because your back is demanding. It's taxing. It takes a lot of mental toughness. And this exercise, doing it first, is more moderate. And it gets you warmed up and it gets you focused before you go on to the more taxing back exercises. I always use wrist straps for cable pull downs because just like with all of the exercises, I don't want to have to concentrate on my grip strength. And so when I challenge myself to that heavier weight, which we need to do to really overload the targeted muscle group, I want that emphasis to be on the targeted muscle group and not my grip. One of the most important things you need to remember when doing cable pull downs is that you want to keep those elbows tucked in and you don't want them to flare out. You've got to concentrate on your lats and keeping those elbows tucked in versus letting them flare out, you'll feel it more in the lats and less on the arms and the shoulders. Now this exercise is cable pull downs in front. I have not done cable pull downs in back for years. I don't think that's necessary to hit the back, the targeted muscle group. Just like with all exercises, you want to explode, in this case going down in the one count, and then you control the weight in the one, two count on the way up. Because of how this works with the weight stack, if you have a challenging weight, you're going to really have to fight the weight and make sure it's controlled and you slow it down on the way up. At the top of the movement, you want to get the great stretch possible but you don't want to come out of your seat and you don't want the weight stack to touch so it takes that continuous tension off your back so you have to find that right balance with the stretch I also find that getting that right seating position is sometimes the biggest challenge to get set up for this exercise with how that pad is on your knees to give you enough room but it doesn't cram you in there too tightly this is probably the biggest distinction when it comes to cable pull downs in front it's where the body position is. Some people are very rigid. They stay upright during the entire movement and they believe that is good form. You gotta remember, this is for your back. You have to open up in order to hit those lats. So you are going to have to lean back at least some to hit your targeted muscle group, the back. Here's the key though, it's the timing of when you go back. You can't lean back too early in the movement because you'll be using a lot of momentum and then to finish it off, you'll be using a lot of arm strength to bring it down. That timing again is very important. So you wanna lean back, but only at the right time so you can open up and hit the lat. 